It's Miss Tanya, Daycare Chronicles 101, and here's your tip for today. Proceed with caution. I have so many providers DMing me, texting me, saying, Miss Tanya, you know, I'm, I'm nervous about taking on new clients, you know, I need an assistant, I'm nervous about that too. All I can say is pray about it and proceed with caution. Check with your local licensing and see what they say, see what public health is saying, do your research online. This is, this is scary, we're in the middle of a pandemic. However, there are still children that need care. There are still parents who have to go to work. My thing with that is, we have to get to know our parents a little more, for me, before I would accept you. Like, I need to know that you're not doing reckless behavior on the weekends, or I don't wanna, you know, look on Instagram and see you out there, you at, you at a barbecue. No, this is not the place for you, if, if, if that's what you're doing. It, it gets kind of tricky with daycare providers because we don't know what's legal to say, what's legal to do, you know. No one is giving us that guidance. And then, you know, licensing will be quick to pop up and say, oh, well, you violated their rights. How? This is my home. Like, we're in the middle of a pandemic. And so, we're basically, the whole country, the whole world is just winging it. We're winging it. That's what we're doing right now. Stay safe. Make sure that your COVID-19 action plan is in place. Make sure it says everything that you wanted to say. And make sure that you go over it with the clients. Make sure that they understand it and they sign it. Once you get their signature on something, they have said, okay, I agree to this. So it's, it's tricky right now. But I just say, you know, we have to be careful on how we handle these situations because we really don't know and we're really not given any you know, legal representation about this at all whatsoever. So just proceed with caution.